Hey guys, welcome back to the Google Guru. Today I'm going to teach you about how to make a table of contents on a Google Doc. And I'm going to show you two different ways to do it. The first way we're going to start out by highlighting the text that we want to put in the header. And then we're going to go to Format, Paragraph Styles, Heading 1, Apply Heading 1. And as you can see it makes this text bigger. You don't have to keep it like that. You can make it smaller, get rid of the bold if you want. And I'm just going to make one more. And you're just going to do the same exact thing. Go to heading one, apply heading one. Then to make the table of contents, you're going to leave a little space before your text. And then you're going to go to insert, table of contents. And there you see the blue text, meaning that it's giving you links. So if you click on the second one, it'll go directly to your second header. And you can also make headers for the subtopics. So I'm going to make one for labels. And what you're going to do is go to Format, Paragraph Styles, and then go to Heading 2. Apply Heading 2. And now if you go back up to the Table of Contents, you have to click on it and then press the Update Table of Contents button on the right. And there you see the labels heading nested under the first one. If you want to make further subtopics, you can keep doing it. You can also just click on this normal text and press Heading 3. And it's the same thing. So you just click on your contents, refresh, and there you have it. So that's one way to make a table of contents and I'm going to show you one more. So here's the same document without the edits. You're going to start off by highlighting the text that you want to put in the header. Go to insert, bookmark, and then I'm going to do it for this one too. So now you have your bookmarks and to make the table of contents I'm going to leave a little space before the text and then you just go to insert link and go to bookmark and then just click on the one that you want to insert and there it is and now to put up the second one you just do the same thing and there you have it and just like the last one you can also put subtopics so you can just press insert bookmark and then underneath do the same thing, insert link, and there it is. So making table of contents is a unique feature to Google Docs in comparison to Microsoft Word because you can make links for all of the headers. So here, these are just two easy ways to do so, and I think they're pretty cool features. So that's going to be all today for the Google Guru. If you have any questions about this or anything else in the Google Apps, make sure to send me an email. Until next time, over and out.